Good morning, YouTube family. This is Take Five with Nanette, where we spend a few moments looking at a nugget of information that has the potential to help all of us change our perspective and learn to think for a change. Um, today, we are talking about first place. And some of you probably looked at that and thought, okay, that doesn't shock me that Nanette's doing a take five on first place. Why? Because I um, am incredibly competitive, for those of you who know me, um, and I, um, I love getting first place. But this actually has to do with the Lord and the Lord's place in your life and how He deserves to have first place in your life. And it is so easy for us to make some, put something else in that place. You want to know what you have first place in your life? What's, what is in first place in your life? What is consuming your thinking right now? Is your thinking consumed? Is it consumed with yourself? Is it consumed with your pain? Um, is it consumed with your past? Is it consumed with fear of what's going on in the world? Is it consumed with your finances? Is it consumed, whatever is consuming this up here is what you've put in first place. And the Lord deserves, He actually deserves to be put in that place. So in order to put Him in that place, we've got to give Him the focus, the attention, the honor that He's due. And we've got to take that other stuff off. What are you magnifying with your mind? Magnify the Lord. Um, the Psalms over and over say, magnify the Lord with me and let us exalt his name. Let us rape, put his name up in first place where it belongs. Don't magnify your circumstances. Don't magnify your past. Don't magnify those thing, those other things. Magnify the Lord and let Him put those other things in perspective because it's only when we magnify the Lord that those other things come into perspective in our life. So that was a reminder to me this morning and hopefully it challenges you to ask the Lord to help to um, not ask the Lord, but for you to actually put him in his proper place so that then he is able to align the other things in your life the way that they need to be aligned and give you an above the clouds perspective of all those other things. So hopefully that's as encouraging to you today as it was to me. Um, bless you and have a great day. Thank you.